Wrath of the Lich King beta is finally here. I initially quit at the beginning of Wrath. I came back at the very end and didn't get invited to anything because I had no achievements and I had no friends that uh, were still playing. So I wanted to go, and especially since we're in the middle of Boomer Month, I think one of the most iconic things about Wrath of the Lich King is them, is, is Blizzard, is, is WoW adding Death Knights as a hero class and doing that intro quest chain, kind of telling you about how Death Knights are, are in the game now, whatever. Uh, and I think it's actually a good fit for Boomer Month and it's Wrath Beta. People are excited for Wrath. And to be honest with you, even me, like, I played a little bit of the Wrath Beta. I did actually have more fun just playing Rhett than I remember having. It felt mechanically a little bit worse. Maybe it's just because I'm so like tuned to playing Burning Crusade at this point. Regardless, Wrath is probably gonna come out, I'm assuming sometime in October-ish. We're gonna take that into Wrath and it's gonna be awesome. I'm playing on Benediction now instead of Fairlina. But yeah, it's gonna be fantastic. A hero, that's what you once were. You stood boldly against the shadow and purchased another dawn for the world with your life. But the evil you fought is not so easily banished. The victory you claimed, not so easily held. For now, the specter of death looms above the world yet again, and it has found new champions to bring about its final reign. Knights of darkness, wielding runes of death and destruction, bound by the will of the Lich King. This is the hour of their ascension. This is the hour of your dark rebirth. There it is, dude. The Lich King. Okay. Clovers, put your clothes on. Frick, claim for free beta keys. Chat, there's no beta keys. I got mine? No, you didn't. Chat, who got a key? Nobody got a key. Stop lying, unbelievable. All that I am, anger, cruelty, vengeance, I bestow upon you, my chosen knight. I have granted you immortality, so that you may herald in a new dark age for the Scourge. Gaze now upon the lands below us. The Scarlet Crusade scurries to undo my work, while Light's hope stands defiantly against us. A blemish upon these plague lands, they all must be shown the price of their defiance. You will become my force of retribution. Where you tread, doom will follow. Go now and claim your destiny, Death Knight. Okay, cool. We're looking good, chat. Things are looking good, things are looking good. Dude, it's crazy, like, so when, when this happened, uh, back in the day, when Wrath of the Lich King initially came out, this thing was so unbelievably hyped up. Like, Wrath of the Lich King, Paladins, Death Knights. Like, this was kind of like the, the culmination. The entire story of Warcraft that people thought about with Arthas and Uther and the Paladins, especially like going into Warcraft 3. Burning Crusade touched on it with Illidan and, and Kael'thas and Lady Vosh and, and that whole thing. You saw Kill Jaden too and Sunwell. But really in Wrath, it was like, that's that's the climax with Arthas and everything else and the Lich King. And there's references to it in Vanilla WoW and there's references to it in Burning Crusade, but it wasn't until Wrath that it was like the focal point of the expansion and adding Death Knights in that was like insane. This was crazy. Instructor Resuvius. This is something else that's cool, right? So if you did Nax Ramus originally, these are all the guys, these are the bosses in Vanilla Nax. So when you come in here and you immediately see Instructor Resuvius, one of the most badass bosses in all of Nax, as in this is the guy in like the military ward who's training all like the up and coming death knights, like you're one of them. So the, the RP behind it is, is legit. You have heard the call of the Lich King Death Knight. Now is the time to answer your master. The single most important piece of equipment to a Death Knight is the Rune Blade. It is through the Rune Blade that a Death Knight commands the powers of Frost, Blood, and Unholy. The Rune Blade also acts as a vessel to store the Death Knight's runic power. The time has come to create your first Rune Blade. Search the weapon racks on this floor and lo locate a battle-worn sword. Once bound, take the sword to a nearby Rune Forge and use it to create a Rune Blade. Okay. Battle-worn sword. Wait, the Death Knights of Arcaris. The heck? Name Jade. Status alive. Comment bloodthirsty. Sixen alive. Chatty. Munch alive. Destructive. Cobalt deceased. Fell to his death. Not much upstairs. Probably saved him a lifetime of suffering. Harmony deceased. The name of this Death Knight was found in violation of common scourge. Decent the sea. Struck down by the Lynch King. Melt. Status alive. Martyr. Wait, what? Status alive. Comment needs more cowbell. 
is that a is that random or does it just put your name in there? I've never I never actually remember reading this book. I just randomly saw it. That is funny. Somebody else should go check this and see if it says your name. Forges the battle worn sword into a rune bladed sword. Must be used near a forge. So you're going through the entire RP of like becoming a death knight. The training. It's cool. Rune bladed sword. Back to Resuvius. <laughs> The rune blade is an extension of your being. A death knight cannot battle without a rune blade. You have successfully created your first rune bladed weapon. With it, you will sow the seeds of chaos and destruction, and in your wake will be a bloodied field of battle, littered with the corpses of all that would dare oppose the scourge. The mark of war is etched indelibly upon your soul, Death Knight. You have learned the dark art of rune forging, and with it, you will engrave runes of power upon your weaponry. Preparations for battle must be made. Return to one of the rune forges here in the heart of Arcaris. Return to me when your blade glows with dark energy. Okay, so I have two runes to choose from. Rune of Cinder Glacier. Affix your rune ribbon with a rune that has a chance to increase damage by 20% for the next two attacks that deal frost damage and sh or shadow damage. Modifying your rune weapon requires a rune forge. And Rune of Razor Ice. Affixes your weapon with a rune that causes 2% extra weapon damage as frost damage and increases enemy's vulnerability to frost attacks. I think this one sounds more fun. I agree. So we're going to take our blade and we're going to take our rune soul blade here. Cool. Dude, a blue weapon. Sick. Remember these words, Death Knight. The Rune Forge is a scourge instrument. It exists only in Alcaris, Naxxramas, and the heart of Ice Crown. You may only emblazon your weapon at a Rune Forge. Return often and emblazon all your weapons. A Death Knight must be prepared for all who would dare oppose him. The endless hunger will soon take hold of you, Death Knight. When it does, you will feel pain immeasurable. There is only one remedy for the suffering. The hunger must be sated, and I give you the key to your salvation. Chained to the heart of Akaris are those deemed unworthy of the Dark Brotherhood. Use the key to free an unworthy initiate and allow them to equip their gear and battle you for their freedom. Fail and suffer for eternity. Live or die, the choice is yours to make. Unworthy initiate dominated. Who do we want to dominate? I will win my freedom and leave this cursed place. It ends here. <laughs> oh, damn. Okay. So, boom. So I want to stack a bunch of diseases and then blood strike. Oh, this guy's owned. This is over. GG. Damn. Okay. Oh, as expected, my chosen knight has triumphed. You are ready, mortar. Behold, Akaris, the Grand Citadel of Death. It has no equal in this world. Not even the mighty Naxxramas could withstand a direct assault from the Ebon Hold. Looming above the face of the Necropolis is the all-seeing eye of Akaris. From it, the Master is able to see great distances into the territories held by our enemies. What the eye sees, the Lich King sees. And now the time has come for you to peer through the eye. The Lich King has called for you, Martyr. Go now and suffer well, brother. Report to the Lich King and Evan Hold. All right. I thought it was voice acted. <laughs> hey. Ah, the time to spill the blood of our enemies approaches. You must first learn what it is that you seek to destroy before rushing headlong into battle. It is what separates a Death Knight from a mindless ghoul. I will grant you sight beyond sight, my champion. Towering above this platform is the Eye of Arcaris. From it, you will call for the probe that you will then use to analyze the Scarlet Crusade fortifications at New Avalon. The Eye has a host of powers that should make the acquisition of this data quite simple. Use the Eye Siphon to analyze the Forge, the Town Hall, Hold, and the chapel. The eye's control mechanisms are located on either side of the platform. Waste no time, Martyr. The Scourge will have this place. The Lich King commands it. Cool. What was that noise? Death comes from on high. The eye of Arcaris launches towards its destination. Siphon summons ghouls on Scarlet Crusade. Shroud shrouds the Arcaris from sight. Okay, so we want to uh, analyze everything. The new Avalon Forge, new Avalon Town Hall, Scarlet Hold, and then Chapel of the Crimson Flame. Dude, this feels like sacrilege, I'm going to be honest. As a, as a paladin, going through and doing this is just, it's just pure sacrilege, Shaft. 
Pure sacrilege. Cool. They prepare for battle, as expected. But there is something else. I sense an old enemy. An enemy that I destroyed long ago. It matters not. We will send the full might of the Scourge against them before they have a chance to evacuate their homes and put in place their defenses. Listen well, Death Knight. For I give to you the words that will start a war. My final judgment has been passed. Death to all. No. Death to all. Take my judgment to High Lord Mograine at the command post of Akiris, found on the first floor. Tell him to begin the assault. And when the crusade has been dealt with, we will finish off the Arch of Dawn. Oh, frick. That's scary. If you're a paladin nerd like me, anything Mograine, anything Ashbringer, like any of that, like anything like that at all is just, oh, dude, I, I loved it. I loved every second of it, dude. Especially back then, like I, I didn't do vanilla Nax, right? Everything about like Nax and the Ashbringer, all that stuff was cool. So throughout the course of this question, they're gonna give you like gear. Cause you start out with like initiate gear, which is like just greens. And they give you like a set of like blue gear. This is why Death Knight is cool that you only tell the cool pally stuff. True. Dude, I remember coming here and seeing Baron Rivendare right next to Darian Mograin. And I was like, Oh, there's the Corrupted Ashbringer noises. I thought this was the coolest thing. So this is Mograine's son. I thought this was the coolest thing, dude. So good, dude. So good. The horns of war will soon echo across this land, waking the dead and calling forth the Scourge Woman. Calling forth the Scourge War Machine. Well, one to those that would stand in our way. You and your brethren will lead the charge, Martyr. When next I look upon the Scarlet Lands, my sight will be obscured by the legions of Arcaris. The march upon New Avalon begins now. Sick. Wait, the battleground started? Calls upon the armies of the Scourge? Oh, frick. Scourge Commander Thalador awaits your arrival at the Overhang, located directly southeast of our current position. Report to Thalador and requisition a Scourge Griffin to deliver your Death's Breach. Prince Vanar will be waiting for you down below. Suffer well, brother. Cool. Okay, so finally, for the first time, we get to step outside. Prince Valinar. Do you smell it? <sighs> Fresh meat. The scent of Scarlet Crusader wafts through the air. Apologies, Death Knight. I'm sure you're not interested in my choice of uh, fine cuisine. You are here to work, to lead the charge. Yes, I know. The Lich King has told me all that I need to know about you, Martyr. The time for bloodshed is now. They make their stand now, outside of Death's Breach. Futilely. Futilely. Uh, they suck at attempting to push back push us back in hopes of saving their horses, mines, lumber, and citizens. This will be your first lesson in scourge warfare. Go to the front lines south of here and destroy Scarlet Crusaders. Leave their corpses so that we may utilize them for the Death March. But most importantly, kill the fleeing villagers. Soldiers dying are an affordance, but villagers? That is what strikes fear into the hearts of man. A quest, Pepe Run, quest time. Uh, so I have to do five duels, but I don't think we have five people to do duels with. They have NPCs to duel, I remember this quest. Death Knight Initiate. All right, let's beat his ass. You don't stand a chance, Mortar. The duel will begin in three, two, one. Get over here. Wait, huh? I guess if you death grip them too far away, then you go out of range of the duel. Here come the tears. Dude, are you serious? Icy touch, plague, blood, blood, icy touch, plague, death coil, icy touch. Okay, horse successfully stolen, so we gotta steal a horse. But we steal it from we steal it from the Scarlet Crusade, and then we also need 15 Sauronite arrows. If chaos drives, let suffering hold the reins. Cool. Oh, there's the arrows. Citizen of Havenshire. So they're just <laughs> They're shooting arrows from up top and just taking these guys out. And so, wait for it. We just have to go pick up the arrows. Wait, this guy's just killing, this guy's just killing the citizens. Oh, you have to kill the citizens too. Oh, my bad. <laughs> I was like, wait, this guy's just murdering people. Class DBZ raids almost all have optimized mana support with wisdom constantly up, shadow priest in every raid. Yeah, like 
it's it's much less of an issue. Specifically, honestly, what it really was an issue for back then was uh, was rep paladins, right? So Death Knight, a lot of people saw, uh, and even now, right, the parallels between a Death Knight and a rep paladin are kind of Death Knights are typically people are like, oh, well, they're like fallen paladins, right? They're they're, they're paladins who fallen to the scourge or whatever, you know? Was this the case before where I could take a little tiny horse? Dude, imagine you're a torrent. You're bigger than the horse. Deliver stolen horse. Um, where did I deliver this? Now, now for, for the, the true test. test. Can, Can you show mastery over an unbound charger and brutally overtake the thing that you desire the most? The horse you stole has been taken to the realm of shadows. It is there that my dark rider will slay the beast and raise it as a death charger. Do you think yourself brave enough to enter the realm of shadows in pursuit of the Death Charger? If you accept, I will transport you to the Shadow World. Once there, seek out a Dark Rider in the open field south. Dark Rider in the open field south of us, while I walk away. Salinor the Horseman at Death's Breach has challenged you to slay the Dark Rider of Akaris and take his Akaris Death Charger. Kill them all. Sick. You know what's funny? I I forgot about this. I forgot that they have like the realm of shadows. Wait, what? What? Okay, this quest is definitely a little bit bugged. This other guy just randomly like said, "Come strike me down," and then he just jumped off and left his horse. So now I got two horses. Return the desert to Death's Breach and call forth Salinor the Horseman. Okay, let's head back. You have served us well, Death Knight. Few of your brethren have survived our initial attack upon the Scarlet Interlopers. You remain as one of the strongest. East of us, past the Havenshire Mine, is the coast, called Light's Point by the Scarlet Crusade. A thousand soldiers stand between us and their ships. Insurmountable? It's hardly the point. In their haste, the Crusade will make one fatal error. You are to return to Havenshire Mine, east of here, and locate the mine car that my minions have planted near the outhouse. Climb inside the mine car, and the Scarlet Miner will unwittingly see to it that you are placed safely behind enemy lines. Once aboard one of their ships, use the cannons against them. Slaughter them all. Call the Scourge Griffin from the cannon when you are ready to return. Scarlet Defender Slay. Let's just slay a hundred Scarlet Defenders. Okay. Ah. Inconspicuous mine car. Oh. Oh, where'd this come from? I better get this down to the ships before the foreman sees it. Job's done. More work? Oh, frick. Uh-oh. Chat, we're behind enemy lines. Scarlet Cannon. Yes. Chat, we have to slay them all. 48, 57, 58, 64, 81, 83, 99. Wait, what? Then we can get the hell out of here, chat. Scarlet Fleet wiped out in a matter of minutes. I will receive a commendation from the Lich King for this. All that remains of the Scarlet Crusade now are denizens of New Avalon. I'll set the Fire Starters and Necromancers upon Havenshire immediately. You will carry my report to the High Lord. I have made sure to include your heroics in the report. Morgan will undoubtedly reward you greatly for this victory, Martyr. Go now. Fallen Paladin abandons light, embraces death in the Lich King champion. True. The entire Scarlet Fleet? I have not seen such a display of domination in years. Since my father wielded... It's not important. Yes, your commendation. Lest I forget. Sick. It is the will of the... <coughs> it is the will of the Lich King that drives us onward, Martyr. None are more aware of this than the Death Knights. Our very existence is intrinsically tied to his consciousness. Surely, you have heard him speak to you. 
You are to return to Death's Breach and report to Prince Valinor. The Lich King commands it. Engraved Saranite pants, plated Saranite bracelet, so I'm starting to get some gear. Okay, let's go back down to return to Prince Valinor. Haven Shire's ours. A thousand corpses litter the, litter the ground, patiently awaiting rebirth. We strike now at our enemy with the awakened strength of the Scourge. The ghouls have already begun their assault upon New Avalon, and our forces have moved in behind them and taken the Crypt of Remembrance. The attacks upon the gates of the last Scarlet Bastion have begun. Our ghouls are wearing the Crusades' front lines. Down while we labor to fortify our new forward base, the Crypt of Remembrance. Venture south to the crypt which borders New Avalon and report to my dear, dear brother, Prince Keliseth. He will be expecting. Prepare yourself, martyr, for you are about to witness the next stage of Scourge Warfare. Right now, Death Knight. I don't remember the quest having voiceovers. Yeah, they, they added it for Wrath Classic. How do you get into beta? There's an opt-in. They're gonna keep- apparently they put out another wave today. Nothing less than total annihilation will suffer, Martyr. Or suffice, Martyr. <laughs> to that end, a few hundred mild, mindless ghouls assaulting the front gate of New Avalon will not do. We must infiltrate the Inner Sanctum and dispose of their officials. They must be shown that no one can escape the Scourge's grasp. Make your way to the New Avalon Town Hall, southwest of here, and assassinate the mayor. Search the building for the New Avalon Registry and bring it to me. We need to find more citizens of New Avalon. Wait, I probably shouldn't do this. Okay, so I'm just gonna get rezzed. Okay, so we killed Mayor Quimby, and then now we get the new Avalon Registry. Wait, how are you here? Okay. <clears throat> the Registry will tell us many things about the Scarlet Insects. Keliseth flips through- oh. Ah, <clears throat> uh, death rates, bursts, but most importantly, movement. Oh, look here, Martyr. They have already sent three vessels abroad. Let me see here. Where are they headed? Uh, lat latitude, longitude. Ah, uh, yes, 18 degrees. Ah, what? This is impossible. They sailed to Northrend? Ah. Uh, uh, beside the coordinates of the words Crimson Dawn. Hmm. This quest makes or breaks speedruns? Wait, really? You know what's funny? So I wrote a post on the forums. Yeah, halfway through Burning... Er, no, 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 no. Was this Halfway Through Burning Crusade? I think it was. Dude, I was a forum poster in, in, in high school. I was like a 15-year-old forum poster. And I would always post about things that I think would be good for them to add to the game. It was like a big, massive hammer that falls from the sky. And like after a certain amount of time does big damage. I was like, that'd be sick if they added that. Then I had another idea for an ability called Long Arm of the Law, which basically because you're the lawbringer, right? Judgment, all this stuff. You reach out and you grab them and you bring them to you to help with like mobility problems for paladins. It ended up being death whip, death, death, death whip. They ended up adding that for, wait, I'll tell you everything, stop please. Oh, hell yeah, nice. The light speaks to the high general. It is the light, the light that guides us. This movement was set in stone in motion before you came. We, we just do as we told, it's, what's, it's what must be done. I know very little else. The high general chooses who may go and who must stay behind. There's nothing, you must believe me. Lies! The pain you're about to endure will be talked about for years to come. No, please! There's one more thing that I forgot to mention. A courier comes soon from Hearthglen. It... Uh. I remember whenever I did this back in the day, this wasn't bad either. So I quit. I, I, I quit at the beginning of Wrath, came back at the end of Wrath, quit again, came back uh, whenever Cataclysm launched. When I came back, I saw execution sentence, and I was like, what the hell? This is exactly what I was thinking. But whenever I used it for the first time, I was like, wait, this ability actually sucks. This was a horrible idea. <laughs> I was like, man, that's crazy. I had the same idea. And then I used it, and I was like, oh, damn, that's ass. Never mind. <sighs> An awakening. What nonsense do you speak, boy? What kind of fool will deliver their people into the very heart of the frozen wastes? Perhaps, though, this courier holds the answer. They have set up a base of operations at the Scarlet Tavern, located at the southern end, southern end of New Avalon. The tavern is tucked away behind, uh, <coughs> is tucked away behind the two orchards. 
adjacent to the Chapel of the Crimson Flame. You are to make your way to the tavern and report to Orba's Bloodbane. He will update you on their situation. I remember Deadlight's Running Quest being so good. It is really fun, Malin. The only thing is, I feel like there's not as much combat as I thought there was. Like, I don't, I don't kill as many things. <sighs> we are the chosen ones, Martyr. Death Knights of the Scourge, sent to sow the seeds of the Master's destruction. Looks like we'll let anyone into the Dark Order these days. When I was given the gift, things were different. Much different. As to this courier, we haven't got a damned clue about when or where this courier is supposed to show up. None of these humans had to answer either. Inside Scarlet Hold, they keep a schedule of all patrol routes. I want you to break into the hold and steal the schedule. The hold is the largest building in New Avalon, northeast of here. Okay, Scarlet Hold, and then, uh... Okay, so Scarlet Hold. I do like how they how they tied Tyr's hand from the Eastern Plaguelands into this. Like, there was this, like, hypothetically, there was this area that the Scarlet Crusade just had inhab inhabited this whole time behind Tyr's hand. Is this Scarlet Hold? Why are you killing the good guys? Because I'm a bad guy. Uh, New Avalon Patrol Schedule. Easy clap. Thank you. Hmm. <sighs> You were foolish coming after me. I failed. I should have been left for dead. Now two of us might be killed. We are Death Knights of the Scourge. This flies in the face of the Dark Brotherhood's covenants. The Sarian, you blasted fool. The alarms have been sounded. Sounded. The High Inquisitor and his acolytes will be here soon. I'm too badly injured to be of much use, but I'll do what I can to help. Slay the High Inquisitor and... His cronies tear off his head and return it to Thessarion. Vengeance will soothe his savage soul. One more thing, Martyr. If you do manage to survive and make it back to Thessarion, tell him that they're executing prisoners at the chapel. Perhaps he'll send you there to play the hero once more. This quest is 100% going to be a problem if there's multiple people doing this quest at the time, same time. Dude, you can't even loot anything. Here, if we have this... Oh, your disease is Valras head. You need to get out of here at once. Go before more of them show up. I'll be fine on my own. Cool. All right, we're leaving. Okay, war plate and gloves next. See, I'm starting to get like the the full suit. The Saren. Make it quick. I'll feed this monster's head to the ghouls. The Saren. <coughs> the Saren tosses his back into the back. Tosses me what? No. Toss. <laughs> the Saren tosses it back. Did Cortero make it out? I'm certain he did. Those walls can't hold him. Time for some payback. The cry for vengeance must be heard. Commander Blood Bladefist and a company of Death Knights are on their way to raise the Chapel of the Crimson Flame. If there are any Death Knights imprisoned at the chapel, Plague Fist will get them out. You can still catch up to them if you hurry. The chapel is due west of here. Tear the hold apart. The schedule is here. These worthless cretins have been busy. Northern patrol routes, southern patrol routes, western patrol routes, eastern patrol routes, but nothing about their courier's routes. Wait a minute. What's this? It looks like the western patrol route. Coming out of western plague lands? This patrol will path through here today. I'm going to need time to plan. We are farmers. Bum, 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 bum. Dude, I, I need to go, like, train. I haven't talked to a... A trainer yet. Chapel of the Chris Crimson Flame. Is that it? Is this it? This has to be it. Have you played a Death Knight before? Uh, not really. I did this quest chain like years and years and years ago, but I, I, I never really played a Death Knight. Are you gonna make a DK alt for Wrath? I don't know. I've always been a one character type of guy. Maybe in Wrath is different. I have no idea. We got here, tore the place apart, and headed toward the prison house. We weren't expecting what we found in there, Martyr. Seems the crusade has been real busy. That whole thing is full of Argentan prisoners. Most of them were already dead by the time we arrived, but a few were still breathing. I was about to go in there and execute the rest of them, but I think you should have the honors. In particular, there's a real feisty human in there that I think you'll take great pleasure. I said, I think you'll take great pleasure in executing. Ellen Stanbridge, Iggy Darktusk, Gobi Blastenheimer. Yasmina Oakenthorn. <laughs> Come to finish the job, have you? Martyr? Martyr, I'd recognize that face anywhere. 
You don't remember me, do you? Blasted Scourge? They've tried to drain you of everything that made you a righteous force of reckoning. Every last ounce of good and... The tech's going too fast? Think, Mortar, think back. Try and remember the hills and the valleys of Elwyn, where you were born. Remember the splendor of life, brother. You were a champion of the Alliance once. This isn't you. Listen to me, Mortar. You must fight against the Lich King's control. He's a monster that wants you to see this world. Our world, in ruin. Don't let him use you to accomplish his goals. You were once a hero and can be again. Fight, Dan. You fight his control. There's no more time for me. I'm done for. Finish me off, Martyr. Do it or they'll kill us both. Remember Elwyn. This world is worth saving. Do it, Martyr. Put me out of my misery. <laughs> Damn, that felt good. Wait, hold on. I'm gonna try and kill his. I'm gonna try and kill this person. I want to see if it bugs it out, because I feel like I feel like they should make it to where you should not be able to do that. <laughs> Dude, the way they turned at me was so funny. Another scourge victory. These scarlet dogs have nowhere left to run and hide. It's only a matter of time now. While you were out burning churches and murdering vermin, I've been busy formulating a plan. The Scarlet Courier is scheduled to pass by the Scarlet Overlook within the hour. The roads by the Everlook, <coughs> by the Overlook, are wide open, swarming with crusaders. Use this makeshift cover to hide the Overlook and wait for the Scarlet Courier to pass. When he's close enough, strike with all your fury. Cut him down and take his belongings, including his clothes. The Overlook is 200 paces east of here. Scarlet Courier's belongings in the message. Okay, so we have to make a makeshift cover. 200 paces east. Frick, that's not east, that's west. Scarlet Overlook, makeshift cover. What the- Wait, did he just spawn on top of me? He spawned right on top of the fake tree. As soon as I put it down, Pretty sure it's supposed to be some kind of RP. Just to walk up to the tree? Yeah, I don't know. Maybe maybe it was like I just put it in the exact wrong spot or something to make it do that. I don't know. Um, is of Hearth Glen and Tirisval will be marching into a massacre? Now for the second part of the plan. You're going to deliver this message right into the hands of High General Abendis. That's what the clothes are for. This message must reach Abendis. I do not want to draw their suspicion. They must continue under the assumption that everything is going as they planned. You will don the Scarlet Courier's clothes and help with, a, with the help of some dark magic, take on the form of the Courier. Abendus is at the King's Harbor, southeast of the Scarlet Everlook. Drop off the message and get as much information out of her as you can. She will tell us <coughs> what we need to know about the Crimson Dawn. Wait, what? Even my horse has... Okay. Man, my horse sucks. <laughs> okay, Scarlet Champions. Ah, yes. Hello, Bishop Street and High Abbot Landgren. How are you gentlemen doing? Oh, Mrs. Abendis. Where have you been? You are two hours late. We were about to send a courier out to the High Commander. The armies of Hearthglen and Tirisfall must not reach New Avalon. The Scourge will slaughter them all. Listen well, Courier. The Scarlet Lands are lost. New Avalon and Havenshire are overrun by Scourge. The Spectre of Death looms overhead and threatens to overtake us at any moment. Return to Galvar with this message. Turn your armies around and prepare your ships for travel to the Frozen Wastes. When next we meet, it'll be in Northrend. Give this to Galvar. The Scarlet Crusade is no more. Long live the Scarlet Onslaught. <clears throat> yes, ma'am. I will definitely do this. Thank you for the message. Why don't you abend this nuts? Thank you. What rubbish! This is the Crimson Dawn. They sailed to their deaths. Let us turn our focus to the encroaching armies. We must prepare for the encroaching armies, Martyr. You will take what you have discovered to Highland Morgrain to one at once. I will open a portal directly to Akaris. Step inside and it will transport you. 
Give Hyrule more grain up in this journal as well. Perhaps he'll find it useful. Make haste, Martyr. Use the portal. Yeah, I'm back. The life we have before is meaningless. The life we have before is meaningless. You did what? You have become an instrument of doom, Death Knight. We will ravage these approaching armies and raise the dead as our own. The armies of Hearthlung and Tirasfall have arrived. As we speak, they prepare to make one final stand. The Lich King awaits your return, champion. He stands watch below us at Death's Breach. Seek out the Lich King at Death's Breach. Go forth and wreak havoc. And let him know where the hood at. Ah, there he is. You have reaped death and destruction for as far as the eye can see, and delivered to me the last of the Scarlet Armies. You have slaughtered legions beyond number, and still your dark heart craves more. Your hunger knows no end, Martyr. Bow before your king. The Scarlet Armies make their final stand against us. For them, there is no escape. For this reason, they will fight with a ferocity that you have yet to witness. Use this horn to call forth one of my words. Climb upon its back and command it into battle. With it, you will end the Scarlet Crusade. Yes, my king. <laughs> Wait, what am I shooting at? I shoot the wrong guys. Yeah! Dude, what, how long is the, how far is the aggro range on these guys? I think I ran into the whole town and they're, look, is there something wrong with the, with the logic here? Something, dude, something, this is, this doesn't feel right. Yeah, look, dude, this thing was, these things were following me forever. Wait, achievement earned? Wait, this guy's elite? Wait, what the, what? These guys were still aggroing me from forever ago? What the? What? I'm getting camped. The stream snipers, dude. I swear. Help. Hey, hey, ghoul. Help, help, help. Hey, 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 help. Why are they, dude? They're aggroing me from halfway across the planet. Kneel, champion. Speak. And then speak. I place this helm upon your head to complete your terrifying message. Any that dare look upon your dark countenance will know that death comes. Let none stand so boldly against your king so as to face your merciless wrath, murder. There remains only one final task. The Scarlet Enclave is no more. What remains of the Crusade will be dealt with in Norman. Survivors. We now turn all of our efforts to Light's Hope Chapel. No longer will this affront to your master be allowed to exist. Go northwest through the cave, into the noxious glaive, and take the path leading out of the glaive, glade, to the mill. Do not fail me, martyr. Slay all who oppose us. Sure thing, dude. I'm gonna get my, I'm gonna go get my, 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 uh, things turned in. I'm gonna get my talents and stuff. The High Lord and other Death Knights are preparing to strike. The Argentan stands defiantly against us at Light's Hope Chapel. They dare oppose the Scourge, and for that reason alone, they must be destroyed. When you are ready for battle, report to High Lord Darien Mograine. It is the High Lord who will issue the final march orders and command our armies at Light's Hope Chapel. Okay. Chad, are you comfy? Where, so I wait right here? Frick, I didn't know it was on a timer like this. Otherwise, I would have I rushed it instead of gotten my, gotten my skills. Oh, here we go. Flesh Behemoth, is it time? Oh, it's time. Coltira Deathweaver, Orbaz Bloodbane, Thessarian, and High Lord Darian Mograin. Chad, it's almost time. I'm ready, High Lord. Let the Siege of Light's Hope begin. Oh, here we go. Over us, minions. Wait, here we go. Wait, what the hell? Man, I'm doing tons of dips. Forces of the light remaining. So I'm trying to decide, like, I feel like, so what they do here is they're, 
just giving they basically make you just super strong dude this feels so wrong i'm, I'm killing my paladin brothers oh there he is paladin's dead bring them before the chapel wait the Syrian is kneeling wait why is the f I did this once on retail, Maxwell Bug didn't stop attacking me then and I kept one-shotting me. That's so funny. What the come oh, on man? Why he dares not show his face. Dude, this is I love this actually. This is so sick. Father, I wish to join you in the war against the undead. I want to fight. I can sit idle no longer. I love this dude. Darian Morgraine. You are barely of age to hold a sword. Let alone battle the undead hordes of Lord God. God damn. I could not bear losing you. Even the thought. There. Stop! Come on! Please! Okay. No! What the game? What? Come on, man! You're ruining it! I have to go! The Lich King. You betrayed me. You betrayed us all, monster! Face the might of Mograin! Pathetic. You're a damned monster, Arthas. No! No, 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 no. Come on! Dude, I need to get the credit for the quest. Oh shit, Mulbrain's coming. He's coming back. He gives Tyrion Forgering the Ashbringer. Arthur! Your end. Impossible. The Ashbringer is cleansed. The Ashbringer has been cleansed, chat. There it is, dude. So that is how the Death Knights join the normal people of Azeroth. They turn their back on the Lich King. Mograine's son's Death Knights. There will be no atonement for us, Marcher. We are forever damned to walk the earth as monsters. <laughs> While the Lich King may have loosed his grip upon us, the specters of our past will forever haunt our memories. We must make amends in the only way we know how. I ask you now to join me. Akaris is a knight of the Ebon Blade. Together we will destroy the Lich King and end the Scourge. Damn, look at that sword. <laughs> yeah, sword, 100%. The Lich King has returned to Northmen, wounded by the Ashbringer, but the second floor still holds the last of his armies. Use the teleporter to get to the second floor and destroy the Scourge forces that remain. Do not engage Patchwork alone. You must fight the monstrosity with other Death Knights of Akaris. Go, Martyr. You have my strength to carry you. Yeah, it's a juggernaut! Yeah! It's a juggernaut! Hey, Patchwork, get your ass over here, bitch. No more play, no more play. Oh, God. Oh, God. I was, I was jogging. Oh, frick. Sick. So th this is like one of the first times in WoW where they, they just make you like ridiculously strong for no reason, right? Like they're like making, oh man, you're this epic thing. Is that right? One of the first times? Um, um, nice. Well done, Death Knight. The remaining Scourge will be dealt with in short order. The rebuilding process will begin anew. I have but one last task for you. This order must establish allies for itself if it is to survive, and you must re represent the Knights of the Ebon Blade to the Alliance. On the platform southeast of me is the portal to Stormwind City. Take this letter, given to me on your behalf by Lord Fortering, and deliver it to King Varian Wren using the portal. Alright. Okay. I'm friendly! 
Hello, I'm a friendly, friendly guy. guy. What? Get a rope? Oh, yikes. I gotta, I gotta talk to the king. Anybody know where the king is? Hello, gentlemen, I'm looking for the king. Okay, thank you. You have mere moments to live. Ah. Indeed, old friend. Blood and honor. Were it not for this letter from Tyrion, you would have been a stain upon my floor. Only an endorsement from one of the greatest paladins to ever live could have ensured your survival. We will work together against the Scourge and against the Lich King. Glory to the Alliance. People of Stormwind, citizens of the Alliance, your king speaks. Today marks the first of many defeats for the Scourge. Death Knights, once in service of the Lich King, have broken free of his grasp and formed a new alliance against his tyranny. You will welcome these former heroes of the Alliance and treat them with a the respect that you would give to any ally of Stormwind. Glory to the Alliance. I bet. Our struggles are I King, you better have a good ass day. Yeah, that's what I thought. Yeah, keep the tomatoes to yourself. Yeah, that's right, bitch. Yeah, hey, right back at you, buddy. Yeah. What? what? <laughs> I did <laughs> Wait, what? Do, do they, they always do that? <laughs> do they... <laughs> do they... Do they always do that? <laughs> what do they do? Oh, all right, dude. Well, there it is. That is the intro quest chain for being a Death Knight in Wrath of the Lich King beta. We saw some bugs. That's uh, a pretty incredible quest chain. It's really, really fun. It's really good. I think it explains how the, the Death Knight come to, to be a part of the uh, the rest of the world like really, really well. And yeah, I'm all 58 now. And then basically you're set up to go straight into Outland and then level in Outland and then go to Northrend. So pretty cool. Guys, if you enjoyed the video, uh, make sure to subscribe and then hit the bell and then hit all. Don't hit personalize. That's a scam. They're not even going to let you know. So if you guys really liked it, do that. Chat, say hi, YouTube, smile. And yes, make sure to subscribe. Come watch my streams on twitch.tv slash sfantv. I do a little bit of everything uh, at this point, but a lot of times I'm doing uh, nothing as well. So come check it out. Cool.